Okay, in this video, I'd like to show you how to join a group in Schoology. Okay, so when you go to your sign-in page, make sure your uh, password, which is usually your email, and then, uh, excuse me, your username, which is your email, and then your password. Log in. And Schoology this year um, has a slightly new look. So for parents who, um, prior to 2018, uh, this is a slightly different way of joining a group, okay? So let me just go ahead and go through that. So for the new parents, uh, it should be straightforward for you. Now you'll notice here at the top banner, it says groups. So please click on groups. And once you do that, these will be all the groups that you currently belong to. Now for the new parents, you probably won't have any groups, okay? So how do you find your groups? Go over to this far right, and you'll see my groups. And go ahead and click on that. For new parents, you'll notice three things. You'll see my groups, school groups, and public groups. Okay, again, my groups is just simply the groups you belong to. School groups, however, will be um, all the groups that uh, you could possibly belong to at Sacred Heart Cathedral, for example. Now, you can do one of two things at this point. You can go over here and just sit, hit join group. When you do that, you'll be given a prompt that wants an access code. If you know that code, then simply put it in and you'll belong to the group immediately. Um, if you don't know that code, let me show you what you need to do. Cancel out. You could scroll until you find a group that you want to belong to. So let's just go ahead and do that. Now, at this point, there are literally hundreds of groups. And I should explain that some of these groups are what we call closed groups, and some of these groups are what we call open groups. Let me give you an example of a closed group, the Algebra Learning Team. Now, the Algebra Learning Team is really just dedicated to those faculty members that teach algebra. So if I click on this, um, you'll see that I'm actually one of the members. So that was really not a great example. Let me just click outside of that for one second and go back. Let me find a uh, group that I do not belong to. So, the Badminton Club. Oh, actually, let me go to Advanced Pre-Cal. Nope, nope, nope. Let me go to African American Studies. There we go. Now, if you go to Ac uh, African American Studies, uh, I do not belong to that group. You'll see the members over here. you also see members listed here. But underneath the title, you'll see a request to join. That means this group is closed. In order for you to join that group, you simply hit the request to join, and it sends an email to whoever the moderator is, and the moderator will send you that access code. Okay, so that's one way of doing it. Again, this is a closed group. Let's go to an open group. Let me see if I can find one for you here easily. Um, let me see, let's see, let's see. I'm going to actually go up to the search engine and type in SHC announcements. There it is. Click on that, waiting for it to come up. And you'll notice that there is an access code listed here. Um, but then you'll also have a button up here. I already belong to the group that will just say join group. And you just hit join group and you should be okay. If it's an open group, it will say join group no other information is needed just hit click the join if it's a closed group like i said it'll say request to join or you have been given an access code somewhere else okay and that's how you join a group in schoology i hope that was helpful to you